back guys, it's edogs82, I'm here with some more Stellaris. So, in the last episode we figured out that uh, we are most certainly not alone in the universe. We have a lot of neighbours cropping up all around us and I do not like that. I will not have that. It is time for war. The people of Gox are going to take over their rivals and claim the land for themselves. Alright, let's press play again. Got our lovely fleet of corvettes here. So the people we're going to go after are these ones, the Obedin Empire. And yep, we've got this random hey, people we found so over here. We're getting all of these guys crowding around us, which is really not good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a crystal guys. <laughs> so let's send our fleet down this way to deal with them. Loads of crystalline entities. So that'll take a little time. Let's take a look at our colonies and how they're doing. Yes, we're expanding here, good. Let's open up some extra lands for them to grow in. Cannot afford it. Uh, I'll fix that. I love the soundtrack, it's so majestic. We have a science ship doing nothing at the moment, but I'm focusing yeah. down on this. Kind of have to. I'm going to allow my people to grow stronger and bigger in numbers. Come on, month, pass by. There you go. Back to normal speed again. Where's that science ship hanging out? Can you come down here and do something about this? Evading hostile fleets. Level four or five. It is. Who's evading the fleet? Hey, come here. I'm gonna beat up on you. What the hell are they moving around so quickly for? I think these crystalline entities regenerate their color when the battle's going. That's what I'm guessing from what I'm seeing the health popping off of them. Okay, that's one group down. Let's hit the next. Another one coming in too. Definitely going to lose some ships here. The fleets of the Gox centralized plants have crushed cr crystal in their wake wherever they go. The crystalline entity's true nature is likely to, be f to forever remain a mystery to us. But what does it matter? Gox forces 
are now exceptionally skilled at annihilating the prisms, and we have, over the course of the campaign, found ways to tune up our weaponry. Mm. Greater Crystal Bounty Empire here. It's, it's an interesting one. Yeah, let's go with this one. Get him, boys, get them. Oh, shit, that eating guy. Awesome, we didn't lose anyone. Go home. What are you doing back there? Come over here and research that. Thank you. And research this and this. Construction ship, what are you doing, buddy? That's right, you're building stations to consolidate my power in this area. Go build me a frontier station. Uh, you're not strong enough? What the hell? Go survey this place. How is Gulek Gu 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 doing? Pretty good, pretty good. I can't expand their territory much. Not yet, at least. Let's give him a science lab. Build up the power plant here. Geferak, how are you doing, buddy? Oh, not too bad, not too bad. You got a few people working out on the colonies. There's not really much I can do for you. Let's um, try and produce a few more things, a few more ships. Construction complete. Yeah. Okay, next thing you know, we're going to save up for another colony ship. Oh, actually, no. We're going to build up our fleet and then go after the Oberdin Empire because... Um, if we can take their worlds from them, we don't need to go colonize. That'll work out. What's our policy on slavery? Yeah, it's all good. Nice. Yeah, I definitely intend on enslaving the Oberdin Empire's guys. Hey, get away from that research, it's mine. I'm going to come back and attack the crystalline entities here as well. Construction complete. Okay, they're repairing up. They're nearly done. Let's speed up the process a bit. Research complete. Okay, they've established an embassy with us. Nice, we got cloud lightning. Research complete. Debris analyzed. Um, we'll do basic combat Sister rolls. Survey complete. Careful, huh? Tropical worlds we could do. Uh, I'm going to do the quicksand basin removal so that we can help growth in that other planet of... Gulek, I believe it is. 
was a guy, Gefrak. Yeah, Gefrak. And Ulex. Both of them. Definitely, I want to encourage growth in my colonies. Um, you are level 5 now. Research that project, please. Words, Golkers, I need you to come there. Okay, we're going to lose energy by moving the fleet away. Okay, who is it? Three. No, I don't want your alien people migrating into my societies. Not one little bit. Uh, go upgrade your ship. Oh, you'll do for an upgrade as well. Okay, so that green shard thrower does 6 to 13 damage, and it does 6 to 12 damage. So accuracy is 75, 75 is range 10, range is 20, average damage 1.5. Construction uh, complete. Cool down. Okay. We will upgrade to the lightning. Oh, we've got to be in contact. Cool. Inquisitor, Buffagan, and the rest of the religious council bids you greetings. We provide spiritual guidance to the Jackley Union and our, our stated goal is to lead this great nation on a path to salvation. Do not cross this path and we may live in friendship. <laughs> you will find yourself no match for us. Yep, that's how we want it now. Oh, we got two different types of destroyers. One type now. Let's put the anti matter missiles there. Cloud light here. Save that. Good. Okay. Where is this? Perfect. Open Empire. Okay. Well, hold the phone. I want to see what's the deal with these guys. Hold on. Just hold on. Okay then. Ships opening. Construction opening. Cool. So we've got our science ship now. All good to go. Come here and survey. So we're starting to push back against our neighbours, claiming as many stars as we possibly can, stopping their expansion where we can. And that frontier outpost is about to be finished, that I'm glad of. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Come on, finish. 
Nice. Now, mine here and here, then right there. Nice. We've taken this area, and soon our influence will spread to here. We're spreading out quite nicely. So that jack we is way over there. We've recovered the remnants of several research logs from the debris field around Najaga 2. Their final entries are all focused on finding a cure for the Javorian pox that was sweeping across the Eurasian Concordat, and they grew increasingly desperate as the situation worsened. The last entry reveals that the pox had spread in an uncontrolled fashion on the space station itself. An attachment details all of their failed attempts to produce a cure in vain hope that the data would be useful to future generations of Eurasian scientists. Uh, okay. Well, that was unfortunate. Go research that. Preparing for upgrades, nice. So what I plan to do here is actually to um, upgrade my uh, space core here in, well in Yadra actually, and then, excuse me, and um, then I'll be able to produce destroyers. And my destroyers will be far superior to these Corvettes. So I should be able to get the leg up on my competition just a bit. At least that's what I hope. Let's uh, take a look at our research. So we've got 14 months here, 24 months. I mean, 26 months. You need a governor. I did not realize that. Uh, let us recruit you. We have the maximum amount. What the? Oh, you have to go, mate. Okie dokie. You need a governor immediately. And you're going to uh, take that one. Silicon life forms. Some kind of burrowing silicon based life form inhabits a vast network of tunnels beneath the barren surface of Yunduk 2. As best as we can tell, the creatures feed off rocks and there is evidence to suggest they possess a rudimentary form of intelligence. Their tunneling efforts have shuffled large amounts of valuable minerals to the surface. That sounds like the Legolo from Halo, who end up becoming hunters. Construction. Okay, recruit you, put you in power. What are we gonna do? Propaganda broadcast. Excellent. What are we gonna do with our signing ship now, huh? Thank you. 
Nope. Yep, go for this one. <laughs> I'm claiming a lot of the space they wanted for myself. You still have a couple of orders left. Yadra can nearly give me a new space port. Let's quickly move to do that because I know it can be quite tedious just watching me do this. But once I uh, upgrade to the spaceport level 3, we'll start to kick some serious butt. We'll go to war. Nice, you've completed the mining station. That'll help speed up the process. Come on, faster. <laughs> Need more minerals. Alien specimen procurement. The director of the Museum of Exobiology on Yedra has issued a request for the procurement of several live alien specimens. These creatures were spotted on surveyed habitable worlds, but they are difficult to capture. It will require the full re resources of a science ship for a lengthy period of time. We will gather these specimens. Situation log updated. Nice. Ooh, loads. System survey complete. Survey system pull. Nice. Didn't want to do that. Uh, track on map. That stop tracking because that's miles away. Apocalypse past. Mushki to a one. Sula was once home to a race of reasonably intelligent beings who destroyed themselves when they were seemingly only decades away from spaceflight. The planet has recovered from what has been immense acts of senseless destruction, but it still bears very visible scars. One of the few remaining ruins on the surface holds a reasonably well-preserved stone monolith inscribed with a message, quickly decoded by Daka Lenex is a warning from the last of the extinct species to whoever they believed would arise after their passing. It was the development of an ultimate weapon that was their downfall. Some quirk in psychology of this species evidently rendered deterrence through mutually assured destruction impossible. Survivors, before dying of unknown causes, soon after hit this weaponry deep underground as destroying them was difficult and left this message to dissuade us from going looking for them. Find those weapons. I am very interested. Track this on the map. Stop tracking. Track this on. Research. Track him. Stop tracking. Everything's over the other side of the ring. Stop tracking. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Yep, that's okay. The ultimate weapon. Come 
come to Najaga. And research that person. Yedra, time to give me that space port. Construction ship, what are you doing? Project complete. Cool, the small rodent-like creatures known as Rinthia are native to El Loro Deklo, where their habitat extends across most of the diverse climate regions. They breed at an extremely rapid rate and seem to have a particular fondness for chewing on electric cables. Procuring specimens was not a problem, in fact, after the initial creatures were collected, more of them made their way onto the Ed Lorad deck law by hitching rides on the scientists' orbital shuttles. Exactly why the Museum of Exobiology requested or the specimens remains a mystery. Done your job here. Come over here and get me more power. Greetings. I am honored to have been chosen by Director Rakex Amala Tika to represent the League of Zemaput Nations in all diplomatic dealings with your fascinating species. We strive to unlock the full potential of technology, a goal we hope we find equally worthwhile. We will not be held back. Come and produce power here, please. Science ship. Are you... Just gonna say, are you do doing something here? Already been researched. Interesting. How much longer? Not much longer. Why these guys went there instead of their home system is beyond me. Starting to force our way in between them all. We're nearly ready for war. So close. Build me two Corvettes if you can. Yes, not. Not yet. Anyway. Oh, I'm yawning so much today. I'm sorry about that. I had a big long day at the shops <laughs> and stuff, you know. I even went to uh, my local RMS and got my. L plates, so I can now drive a car. That's pretty cool, huh? All right, we got another contact. You, uh, we are the Trillian Interplanetary Kingdom, a peaceful nation ruled justly by our beloved Queen Sixidulf. I do not know what barbarity or bizarre species is capable of, but we hope future grievances can be settled through dialogue rather than violence. You'll find yourself no match for us. Obviously, when they're so weak like that. That's them over there. That's the other guys that we found not long ago, and them, and yeah, everybody's starting to pop up all over the damn place. Alright. We can now produce destroyers.
that's building up, that's researching, that's nearly done. Things are going up good over here, seven more months until we've got the basic combat roles. Special project complete. Ooh. Zolkor swarm secured. The Zolkor are swarm meaning insect analogues. Usually both un unusually both for their uh, unusual both for their large size and the fact that they are lithovores, feeding off rocks and minerals in the ground. Hey, don't eat the minerals, I need those. One of the shuttles belonging to the research expedition vessel sustained serious damage when it inadvertently passed through a large swarm and several Zucklaws began to feed on its hull. Ooh. The construction of the special containment facilities required to hold these creatures has already begun at the Museum of Exobiology from the Agile. Excellent. So now what? Uh, seventy one per cent done there. Have we explored all of this? I think we have. And more people. Greetings from the Hadam Confederation. Chancellor Chancellor Hashk Kalash is our elected representative. But in truth, all citizens have a voice in our government. We strive to better ourselves through technology and a desire we hope you will respect. You will find no, yourself no match for us because you are weak. Construction ship. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Come over here, please. Research complete. Nice. Construction complete. Let's do habitability. Awesome, we got a new spaceport construction done. That means we've got 10 ships, 10 corvettes, and they're okay. I, I thought they would be a little stronger, but Special project it's not. Complete. Interesting find. It seems the people of this planet were experimenting only with what we would consider to be fairly basic weapons technology. The havoc they wrought is more a testament to their incredible genocidal tenacity than it is to the power of their weaponry. Ah, oh, we got mass drivers. That's funny as. I'm going to put the mass drivers on the front of my destroyers. And the corvettes will get a mass driver as well. Small, yeah, okay, upgrade, this science ship is doing nothing, nothing at all, come over here and survey this system please. Seems in order to get the specimen that I need, I need to get into these people's place, which won't be too easy to do. But I need to quickly 
assert my control over the Oberdin Empire before they become too much stronger. Research complete. What research? Ah, basic combat rolls, nice. Disruptor will affect what? Their shields? Let's go with this disruptor. It's gonna take a while, but it's worth it. Let's um stop that for one second. No, that's not what I want. This, okay. Go aggressive. Okay, we'll save that design. Cool. Um, let's make my destroyers do it as well. Now, upgrade. System survey complete. Uh, okay, yep, yep, yep. I know what I'm doing here. We're going to build a military station. Research complete. Can you come this way and try? What did you research? Nice, we got the destroyer assembly yards done. Oh, quantum missiles? I've never seen these. Oh, they're so powerful. Yup, get in it. That's sick. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, their bonuses are huge too. It's gonna take a while though. T4, nice. I can't wait. Destroyer assembly yards. How much more powerful are my Corvettes gonna be on that? He's finished upgrading that area to a base. Ships upgrading. Ooh, a little bit. Not a lot, but a little. Okay, there's a new rivalry going on. System survey complete. Nice. On oh, that destroyer assembly yard, please. over here and continue surveying as much as you can. Construction ship, I need you to move your hiney and build up some bases of defense for my people. Uh, you're going to end up being in the red because I have no structure here. System survey complete. And you guys are surveying so fast. Go survey this place. Well, I can move this stuff off of here now, then. Nice. Um, yeah, go develop over there. That'd be most helpful. Thank you. Thank you very much.
Soon we will conquer the Oberdin Empire. System survey complete. And that was quick. The system have nothing to offer. Construction complete. Construction complete. I just don't have enough resources. I'm always lacking resources. need a lot of resources to start a war. System survey complete. Oh, again, man, you guys are System surveying like a gun. That's ridiculous. Transmission. Hmm. Okay. Situation log completed. System survey complete. down for a minute and take a look at our vessels. Our defense platform is currently packing these things. Them mass drivers. It's got the antimatter missiles already. Awesome. Okay, we don't want him slipping in through our areas. So let's get you moving over here. That's nearly in our control. I believe it will be before they get it. System survey complete. Golly, these guys are surveying like a mad dog. Just a little more. Got to build up a bit more and then we can be okay. Let's talk diplomacy with these guys. And my rivalry. I will offer you a non-aggression pact. If you offer me a non-aggression pact, I can guarantee your independence. I'll give you my star charts, my active sensor link. You can have military, civilian, and station rights. 
Wow, this guy does some orange crap. You can have energy. No, nope, you don't want energy. Research. You're okay with research? No, you don't want none of that. Okay, I've got 21 populations across three planets. Yes, it is. Okay. Okay. Well, first I want to System check out these guys and see how they are. They're equivalent to me in every way. So they have 21 populations across three worlds, the same as me. Okay. So they're keeping up with me at this present moment. Let's build a destroyer. That's going to take a lot of money and a lot of time. Situation mode completed. Yeah, we got more aliens up in this joint. Let's come over here so you can build a new. Um, mining station once you have the money. The minerals. <coughs> Jesus, it's taking a while to get over here. And go for it, mate. System survey complete. Construction complete. Nice. Survey that system. Go upgrade. Thank you for the extra minerals. You're awesome. And we have our destroyer. Nice. Sitting back here looking all awesome and massive. System survey complete. Can we build another? No? Oh, yes, only just. Ooh, who is this people? Fly aliens? Okay. Come this way, survey there. I am most interested in knowing who the fire aliens are. Evading hostile fleet. And these aliens. All the aliens. Crystalline entities, huh? There's more of you buggers out here. Transmission. We're receiving a transmission from Riva, Viva, Filva. They appear to be to have successfully translated our language, diplomatic channels are now open and all hostilities between us have ceased for the moment. Oh, what the hell is that? Some plant monster thing. I bring greetings from the Grand from Grand Marshal Siphon Uvi Ivanfin. The undisputed ruler of the Imperial 
Lalindra sons. Respect our borders and keep out of our affairs and perhaps our mighty fleets will refrain from visiting your worlds. <laughs> we'll fight for our right to exist. Missing in action, what the? Ships upgraded. Construction complete. Who are you? System survey complete. Military dictatorship. Dude, you guys would get wrecked by me. <laughs> so much big talk, that's funny as. Space Nomancer. Uh -oh. Greetings, Gox Grand Marshal. I speak on behalf of the United Nomadic Fleets. You have nothing to fear from us as we have no interest in planet bound affairs. We ask only that you respect our autonomy and our right to go where we will. You are not the first to lay small claim to the vast expanse we travel. Our history is full of many just like you, but none of our contacts remain active at this time. Not anymore. Should that change, we may eventually share communications with any of your fellow planet dwellers that we come across. Greetings. You've encountered some form of alien vessel in the Yadrak system. These strange objects have been flagged as human confederation. Whoa, what the hell? Until we can learn more about them, we should be proceed with caution. There is a lot going down in the Yundux system. What the hell? I'm a little, um, a little bit anxious about that. To tell you the truth. Let's make you a power station. Who died? Oh, great, our leader's dead. Or one of our leaders, what the hell? Not a governor. At least it's not a governor. Okay. You're over there. Survey that. You are where? Back in my system. Interesting. Okay, go over here and survey there. It's going to take a while, but go do it. <laughs> Spaceport. Let's build some more destroyers. What? Alliance invitation? Tuxcan commonality join the celestial axis. Human confederation join the celestial axis. Human Confederation. Where are you guys located? Soul 3. Okay, so they're all located over here. Systems Alliance right there. They're the people that I created. Uh oh. Uh oh, that could be a problem. Take me to my ship. Construction complete. Why 
Why is he here in Yandere? Research complete. System survey complete. Um, I need more power, so come here. Research. Nice, we got more habitability. Uh, regenerative hull tissue might be worthwhile. System survey complete. Okay. More people. Golly. Alien creatures, I speak on behalf of Grand Marshal Obra Plot, the undisputed ruler of the Sarthid Imperium. Respect our borders and keep out of Sarthid affairs. And perhaps our mighty fleets will refrain from visiting your wretched worlds. We will fight for our right to exist, Sarthid. Okay. Come over here and survey. Ooh. Jasper of Empires, war with him, yeah, yeah, okay, they're the rivals as well, wow, space is really starting to uh, fill out, I need more power, Captain. Move here and build that. Then build over here. Cool. Are you building more? You are now. One more month away from producing another one. Nice. System survey complete. We called their embassy, upgraded, finished that. Cool. This spaceship is crazy fast. It's pretty good power, I would say. So we have five destroyers, ten corvettes. Got ten more fleet capacity. What do you want? Migration access? No. System survey complete. Construction complete. Oh, nice. And you're going to come up here and do the final survey in the galaxy that I can get to. Because the Satid Imperium is in the way. Goodness. I wonder if the other races I've created are somewhere around the ring of this universe that I'm inhabiting, considering I created the Systems Alliance. System survey complete. Build another destroyer. Research complete. And you can head on home, buddy, because there is nothing more for you out here. Okie dokie. I'm going to keep you looking for more power to harness. And I found some. Nice. We've got some more research coming up. Let's get the solar panel network. Construction complete. How are my colonies doing? They're doing okay. Could be better. But we are a slow growing people. So I understand. I do. Ah, oh, stiff neck. Nice, we've got a population growing here.
We're almost ready for war. Almost. At this rate, I should have close to close to two thousand um, fleet power by the time I start my attack against the Oberdin Empire. Hmm. I wonder if my people will ever grow out of the slow breeding trait and start breeding at a normal rate or even fast. I wonder. Queue up another destroyer. System survey complete. Nice. What is that? Ooh, war. Construction complete. You, I need you to uh, come and upgrade. You, show me where you are. What is this? Ooh, another war. People are getting ready. You're all like, yep, let's do it. Let's go to war. This means war. I'm lucky nobody's um come after me yet because I'm surrounded. But then again, my enemies are also surrounded. <laughs> So it's going to be a battle of whoever can kick the most butt the quickest, basically. I haven't totally uh, blocked off all access to my lands just yet, but I will. Ooh, their influence just grew, I saw that. I don't like that. Oh crap, they have four worlds now. Their fleet power is inferior, I can crush them. I can get two more, ooh. ooh. Can get two more um, destroyers and then we're, we're good. Okay, I need a new scientist. And we lost another guy. <laughs> Holy crap. Reset speed, Voidcraft. Field manipulation, yeah, we're gonna need shields and stuff. We haven't done much of that. Four months until we get the get the what is it, the solar panels. Ooh, those guys are going to war. Be 
Jesus Christ. <laughs> the Human Confederation. <laughs> I only own one fly in it. They're super weak. I'm surprised they're still around. Okay, they've got a right new rival. It's good to know. People are fighting other people, not me. Don't really want them to fight me. Okay. Research complete. Nice. We got the solar panels now. Ships upgraded. Construction. Let's get complete. cold fusion power. Um, what do I want to do with you? You're not in my space, are you? Oh, you are, actually. Okay. So come here. Enter orbit. When you can build a military facility, do it. Okay, they're going to war with somebody else. It's cool by me. Um, place it over there. Oh, we're going to just get over 1,000 fleet power then, I guess. In the end. Back to passive. It's evasive, nice. Evasive. The negotiations for appointing a new Grand Marshal are underway. What the? Ooh, ouch. Nice. So you built military station, good stuff. Uh, I need to build you one here as well. Potentially, I want to build a military station everywhere within all of my star systems, but it's just not 100% possible. Not really. Hundred and eighty-one. That's all I need for the next destroyer. So just a few more months will need to pass for that to happen. And then we can go to war. Just itching for a fight at this point. So much build up. Ah. What do I want to do with the Obedient Empire? Do I want to take them out? Do I want to vassalize them? I think I want to vassalize them because they seem like they'll be a strong ally to have. And I need allies when it's like this, and then I can turn my attention to this front and push this way, rather than having to um, deal with expanding that way and that way. Situation Okay. We got more people in my area. Star Imperium. Okay. Oh, 
Where do you need to head to next? Move over here. Construction complete. Alien situation account updated. Cool, we got more aliens trespassing our lands. Man, they're really starting to stack up. I think every patch of star land has been like picked up and owned by just about everybody. How many empires did I put in this? Okay. Void skulkers. Come over here. Negative balance, yeah, 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 I know. Solar panel network. If I can balance out the energy deficit before we start, that'd be great. Just over a thousand, nice. to vassalize you. Oh, no, you don't. Ah, no general. That could be a problem. Hostile fleet engaged. Ready for us, huh? <laughs> yeah, right. Updated. Nice. Come destroy their mining efforts. complete. Oh, 
construction complete. Go for it guys, go on your own. I'm going to build us a military station here once I get enough resources, aka minerals. Situation log updated. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Too easy. Debris analyzed. their home world. They haven't built up anything here, interestingly enough. Nothing here either. Huh. This is why it's going to be easy to beat them. Because they're not utilizing their um, resources properly. Here we go. Oh, they have a sizable fleet. Frigate. Situation log updated. Debris analyzed. I'm not happy with that. I don't want to get near the spaceport and them because I need every little advantage I can get, so I'm going to hang back and then try and draw them back into me. Research complete. That way I can... Oh, quantum missile, yes. Kick their butts. Um, let's go cruiser. Hostile fleet engaged. Okay. Quantum missiles. Huge damage. Situation log updated. Debris analyzed. Disruptor. Save that design. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Okay, not Hostile enough power. Fleet engaged. We'll give it a bit more. How are things going in? Not so great, but not so bad. Come on, boys, you got this. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, we lost that one. Not good. Interesting, I didn't know that they could get in here. Apparently they can. Oh, right! They had a outpost. That's why my area stopped right there before. Can't really build my fleet up at the moment. Don't have the resources. Unless I do this. Production targets. Nice. Production targets and you as well. Let's build you a basic mine. I've been playing for quite a long time now. Um, that was our first scrap with the Oberdin Empire. Oh, and now they here trying to attack my people, getting wrecked by my military stations. Which they have to try and blast through a whole bunch of them because I put them basically everywhere. <laughs> so things aren't going to go so well for them. I'll whittle them down bit by bit. Okay, so they destroyed that station, but that was a weak station. They'll probably move on to here or here. Yeah, they're probably trying to come to Yajnak, which doesn't have a military station at it, but it does have my spaceport level 4. Yep, we're here. They're coming straight for the capital. They're getting murdered even more because totally unmatched. They have shielded technology up. Maybe, yeah, I was going to say, maybe some pressure should alter my stuff for that, but I have. Nice, kick their butts. After this little, uh, fight I'll end the episode because it appears that my uh, military station is going to destroy them. See this is what, what I've been preparing for the whole time. I knew I'd probably get beaten in a space battle in their home system so I prepared my system everywhere with military stations just to blast him into space. Tiny little pieces. <laughs> OK, 
Come on. What are you guys doing? You're not even fighting back. It's ridiculous. You're losing your whole fleet. Another one? Oh, they brought more. <laughs> That's funny. You come to the home system and build me a new platform. Situation log updated. Let's make that disruptors. Okay. Ugh, don't move. Yes, overwrite the design. You stop what you're doing. Now build me one. Oh, look at that. They're actually in my home system. How did they get it past all my other defenses? System survey. Interesting, I thought I killed them. Guess my, my defenses weren't as powerful as they could have been. They've just cut a line straight through, and now they're hitting my other colony. It's like the one colony that has no defenses. You dirty, rotten Obedians. Well, I'm going to get you for that. I'm going to build me a destroyer and come back in the next episode when it is fully built. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm a bit of a cliffhanger right here. I don't like cliffhangers myself, but this episode has been going for a very long time, so I need to <laughs> do something about that. And so I have to call the episode now, but... I will return, never fear. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye. Get more bang for your buck with a two-dollar handler.
Thank mm-hmm. you. 